At noon, some of the people named in the Fulton County grand jury indictment are tied to alleged criminal activities that took place outside of Fulton County. Anthony Montalo is a coffee is in Coffee County with the very latest developments there. While it's a few hours away from Fulton County, the Coffee County Board of Elections, or what was the Coffee County Board of Elections, plays one of the central roles in DA Fani Willis's investigation. In fact, the phrase Coffee County comes up more than 52 times in the indictment handed down Monday. The town of Douglas is quiet Tuesday, and many of the folks we've talked to say they haven't even heard of how the Coffee County Election Office is named in the indictment. This part of the investigation focuses on four people, with Trump campaign attorney Sidney Powell in the spotlight. Now, according to the 98-page indictment, Powell allegedly worked with an Atlanta data firm to copy election software and information from Coffee County voter machines. It also accuses former Coffee County Republican Chair Kathy Latham and former election supervisor Misty Hampton of allowing unauthorized people connected to the Trump campaign access to the secure area in the county election office. Now, six of the 41 counts mentioned in the indictment relate to things that allegedly happened here in Coffee County, including conspiracy to commit election fraud, computer theft, computer trespass, and computer invasion of privacy. In Coffee County, Anthony Montalto, 11 Alive News.